Alright guys, we're back and now I can kind of explain the coloring of these guys. See, here's the black and white guys. They go through this coloring like machine and they come out colored. Yay! So I guess these are machine maids and these are javits. So whatever. I don't see the difference. <laughs> the paint job will not make them stronger. And those guys in the back there are forging them if you don't notice. You there! Are you the one in charge here? Do you know what your weapons have been doing to our world? Such nonsense at once! I'm afraid that isn't possible. Any descent against Smithy will be dealt with by immediate meltdown. <gasps> meltdown? You can't scare me. I've got Mario by my side. And a lazy shell. <laughs> Dissenters will be eliminated. Production will continue. Bring it on! And, uh, wow, here comes Spritz Bomb. Mm, that's not going to hurt very much, will it? Oh my god, it did! <laughs> Remember at the attack? Oh, Poundettes. Those are the girl version of the Pounders, I guess. <laughs> and aren't they pinky cute? Anyway. <laughs> you know, I guess I will be... Uh, no, not, don't attack the director. Leaving one just like I was battling uh, uh, Johnny back in the sunken ship. I guess when they get alone, then they boost their attack and defense power, is what the managers, I mean the directors do, so yeah, just try not to leave them alone, and yeah, now we can just attack the director like there is no problem, and I just got it once again, which means I can attack him right away, and this is gonna hurt him a lot, because I am feeling strong after those couple level ups. <laughs> Oh yeah, the most sexist item ever in gaming. Oh god. <laughs> hey, let's do much damage. Oh, 16. I'm quite surprised about that. Yay! Attacking the lazy shell. With, I mean, the lazy shell too, the director. And, well, oops. I was, why did I press the Y button? It wasn't Peach's turn. I was going to do a group hug orgy for everyone. And here it comes. Oh, I'm feeling so good. Like we're hippies. <laughs> Just kidding. And, oh my gosh! <laughs> Damn, the lazy shell will. Uh, oh, and that works for me. Uh, guard. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and I'm gonna have to do comeback for Gino just for the heck of it because it's just gonna work that way. And uh, yeah. As you see, even the uh, the music for these battles aren't even taking these guys seriously. It's just the regular battle music. It's not like these guys are a boss or anything like that. Uh, otherwise, it would be indicated by one of those two boss tunes. But, you know, by their appearance, and you can only battle them once in the game. And this is it right now. What I'm showing you here is the only time you can battle these three dudes. And, uh, as you see, they aren't very powerful at all. So, except for those bombs. But, as you know, I just keep making, uh... Uh, characters come back with Peach, and that's not gonna... Okay, wow, 128 damage. That reminds me, what the heck happened to uh, Super Mario 128 or something? Or was that just a tech demo or something for the Wii or GameCube, whatever? Because I always, I always hear Nintendo mention Super Mario 128, and uh, yeah, all I see is like those a whole bunch of Marios running around on screen. And I want to have a gameplay made out of... I mean, a game made out of that. <laughs> They've been just tempting us with that name, but seriously, I do think it's a, like a tech demo or something like that. And uh, oh, that takes care of the director. Woo! <laughs> and uh, let's hit the palm nuts with all of our might. Woo! And that takes care of this battle, I guess. Yay! And uh, oh, I guess Peach was still cowering through that entire battle, but it sure didn't look like it. That was scary. We can't run away now. We've got to kick these low lives out of our world. Holy cow! Look at Peach. She looks steam. She is giving those hammers the finger. Can you see that? Oh my God! Look at that. She's giving them the finger. I am not making this stuff up. You've seen that. <laughs> Oh, I got an angless writing. There we go. <laughs> wow, she is ticked off like no thing. Hit the save file here. And we are going to save our game and see what is beyond this door right here. What's going on? What is this here? What is this? That is. Mario, I'm surprised to see you here. But this is the end of the line for you. This is the closest you'll ever get to Smithy, so savor the moment. <laughs> you'll be fodder for my incredible invention, the gun yolk. Oh my god, what's going on? 
This is the boss battle of the factory. There's the gun yoke and there's the factory chief. I don't know who I should attack first. I'm gonna go with the factory chief just because as I say I always attack the little guys first. But he looks pretty powerful so we're gonna see how long this takes to beat him. 103, maybe not long enough. Whoa! What the heck is that critter? And here comes a mega drain. It's gonna hit one person. Go for Peach. Yeah, go for Peach as I was saying. Yeah! Most sexist item ever. Oh, oh fungus spike. Like, it looks like this factory chief is like some sort of ninja because he's shooting fungus uh, <laughs> shuriken at me. But anyway, back to the lazy shell barrage. Uh oh, what's going on? What's going on? This is going to be a breaker beam. Oh, no! The breaker beam is back! <laughs> you remember the breaker beam from the Axum Rangers fight? Well, this time it looks like we're powered up enough that it can't kill us in one hit. So it looks like this battle is going to be a lot easier than the Axum Rangers second part. And uh, so that also means it's going to be a pretty easy fight. Which makes me a sad panda. Actually, more like a sad PK gam. <laughs> Whatever one of those things are. You can't buy one of those things at a pet store. This is an exclusive thing that you can only find on my channel. <laughs> oh, Echo Finder. Oh my god, 111. That is not pretty. That is not pretty at all. <laughs> I wonder if I'll have to attack the gun yolk. I'll I probably will. Uh, I think I really should be focusing on the gun yolk over the factory chief anyway, because just how much damage the gun yolk does compared to the factory chief, and that's gonna turn me into a mushroom. Or just kill me in one hit, that'll work. Okay, so they can both do pretty good damage. So I'll go for the weaker guy first, not the gun yolk. Oh no, no, the breaker beam. <laughs> Such power! How was in that little critter? Well, at the same time, it, well, it does have a good amount of power. Since it can't KO in one hit, it's not nearly as broke as it was back at the Axum Rangers. But at the same time, it wasn't broke back at the Axum Rangers because I was able to survive it with Peach and Revival and stuff like that. So, either way, it's uh, working out pretty well for me. <laughs> Oh, that just killed the factory chief, and I got an attack up, and that is going to be pure ownage. And we got a mega drain attack coming from that potaboo like lava critter, and that's just gonna kill Mario. <laughs> like it was just no thing. <laughs> and coming back to life. Oh, yeah. Nothing feels better than that. <laughs> Yay! And then. Uh, Keep attacking the gun yolk. I don't even know why it's got the yolk suffix to it. It should be like gun barrage or gun breaker or something like that. I don't know how to call it. What's gonna happen? No! Breaker beam comes every other turn and it doesn't have to take a turn to charge. So this is powerful stuff right here. Oh my goodness! Everyone survived it. <laughs> I am surprised. Well, actually, I'm, 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 I'm sure that Peach would have survived it, but uh, the other two I didn't think would, because I thought they took some more damage. Ow. Okay, that just worked. So I'm gonna group hug for this turn. I think that would be a wise investment in my turn. And that looked like it, it healed Mario with the shininess of it. And it looks like I'm gonna have to cut this part.